Our top story here at 5 o'clock, an update tonight in the case of the late McFarland City Manager John Wooner. Bakersfield Police documents obtained by 17 News Today reveal that John Wooner had been accused of sexual misconduct at work and that he had threatened to sue the city. 17's Eitan Wallace reviewed those documents today and joins us now in studio with more on what he found. Eitan. Well, these documents include statements made to police by elected McFarland representatives, including the mayor, and by Wooner's wife, who provided details about the last time she ever heard from Wooner. John Wooner served as McFarland city manager for eight years before he disappeared last May. Two and a half months later, his body was found in a McFarland city car in the Kern River. Now, new documents from BPD shed light on Wooner's life in the moments before he disappeared. John Wooner's wife, Jennifer, told police on the last day she saw him, Wooner asked where his father was buried, and she told him Hillcrest Cemetery. Jennifer Wooner said John Wooner asked specifically where he was buried within the cemetery, and so she told him. She then said Wooner expressed interest in going to see the grave of his father, Orville. His wife said this was, quote, odd due to the fact that his father died of suicide 16 years ago and John Wooner has not been to his grave since the funeral. Hillcrest Cemetery was the last place John Wooner was ever seen alive. And there's more in the documents. In her statement to police, Jennifer Wooner said her husband was, quote, made aware of possible sexual misconduct allegations brought against him. And Wooner's wife added the allegations, quote, put a lot of stress and depression on John Wooner. McFarland Mayor Manuel Cantu said to police, Wooner was upset due to the fact that the McFarland city budget was going to be approximately $180,000 short. Cantu said that Wooner requested he fire him so Wooner does not have to deal with any more negative attention from city council member Rafael Melendez. Cantu added Wooner was planning to sue the city of McFarland for a hostile workplace environment regarding Melendez. The documents indicate Melendez pushed for several agencies to investigate the sexual misconduct allegation against Wooner that was brought by a woman who no longer works for the city. But when Melendez was questioned by police about this, he stated the entire office knew about the sexual misconduct incident. However, it was downplayed and did not go anywhere. Now, in the documents, Mayor Contu goes on to say there was no indication money was missing from the city. Meantime, we reached out to the named officials and to Wooner's wife, but we did not hear back by news time. In Studio A, Tom Wallace, 17 News.